Hello and welcome to 15 Minute Gamer. It is a chair. But why is a chair here? Why? That's my hand. That's my other hand. Yeah, I've got a bit of a difficult setup, so I'm not going to be able to jump in front of the camera. But why are we here? We're here because I have a new toy. Yes. If you follow me on Twitter, you would have noticed because I've been going on about this for a long time. I pre-ordered this a few months ago and it came today. What is it? Can you guess? Dun, dun, dun. It is the Oculus Rift S. Ooh. This is the new Rift from Oculus. Some are calling it the 1.5 version, which is, you know, fair enough. I don't think it's quite revolutionary. I don't think it's changed too much from the original, but it has a uh, better resolution, better control and contact, better room scale, better everything. So everything just seems to have been improved a little bit. And I am excited. I've wanted one of these for a very, very long time, like ages, but I've never been able to justify it. And when this one got announced, I was like, you know what? I am going to jump on the Oculus VR bandwagon. I have a few games to play. Um, I'm looking forward to playing things like Project Cars on it, um, a set of Corsa, Elite Dangerous, and I've also got a few in my Steam cart at the moment. I, for one, have not played much VR games. I'm going to have to admit that I have played the Star Wars one and the little Valve Room one as well, but apart from that, I'm going to have to say my, my VR isn't that good. So, let's see what's inside the box, and obviously that means a jump cut. And we've completed the jump cut. Look, here it is. Now, <laughs> for £399, which is how much this is, I was expecting maybe a little bit more. Boom, when I opened the box, it, there's nothing in here. But let's see what we're going to look at first. We'll have a look at the controllers. So these are the two controllers. So there you go. You've got your trigger buttons on the side and the top. And you've also got your little directionals there, and then your buttons there. I have not used this one. I used mine with a controller uh, when I had a go, so I'm not sure how these, uh, yeah, how these operate. But we'll soon find out. So yeah, they're the two controls you get. Now we'll put them to one side. Now there's a little black uh, box, which I'm guessing has some sort of setup. Yes, it does. And safety warning, and some cables. That's all very exciting stuff. What's it? What is that? Um, that seems to be some sort of USB to display port. I'm not sure about that, because I thought this had to be HDMI. Oh, we also have some batteries. So I'm guessing the controllers use batteries. Got the package that tight in there. Oh, good God! So we've got some batteries. You would have thought Duracell, maybe. And that is it. So that's that contents. So these must open up to put the batteries in somehow. Hmm. That's going to have to be instructions on that, I think. It does feel really light. So yeah, we're going to have to have a look through there to find out how to put the batteries in. Right. The bit you've been looking for, the VR headset. And here it is. So it's got its little cameras on there. It is first impressions. My cable's going to drop down, I guess. Quite light. So you can see around there. Quite light. It's got a little strap up there. Lots of padding by the looks of it. So quite a bit of padding. That is the pack I'm guessing plugs into my computer. So I'm going to have to play around with that. And yeah, that's what I'll be looking like when playing this. It feels really light. It doesn't feel heavy. Which is good. I'm not sure what that switch is on there. I guess that's another thing to find out. <laughs> it looks like a camera. So I'm guessing maybe that's something to do with the room scale. I guess that just Yeah, that seems to adjust how big it is. And yeah, that's kind of what's in the box. That's all there is. Two controls, some batteries and some there. Uh, that stuff I was expecting a little bit more. But... That's what you get. So I hope you've enjoyed this little video. There's going to be a lot of, well, I hope a lot of VR type games on here. I'm looking forward to giving it a go today and tonight. And I'll be posting some footage, no doubt. So thank you very much for watching. That was the Oculus Rift S unboxing video. And I'll catch you all later. Goodbye.